Welcome back to Satisfactory, folks. We are building our new uh, base here. So if we just click run on. So down here we have a bunch of containers for all the stuff that we'll be producing. And up here we have some production set up. Smelting. A lot of smelting. So there are... How many are there? 4, 8, 12, 16 uh, smelters on each side. For a total of 32. And they're set up in sections of 4 because we have the Mach 2 belts which can carry 120 resources. And each of these uh, smelters can handle 30 per minute and so that's what we'll be doing so 30 times 4 is 120 and every time it's so we have the first four here so one two three four the ingots then go up above and the next four place theirs and then the ingots go a step up again the next four and then let's go a step up again and the next four so yeah so that's a total of 480 ingots uh, a minute uh, that we'll be making on one side and over here i've also set it up uh, oh i forgot to set up i think well actually i didn't forget uh, i'm not sure if this will be iron or copper i'm thinking maybe copper uh, but I'm not entirely sure yet. Let's uh, run over to our messy starter base here and have a look. So I have set up a thingy here, um, an awesome sink, which has been going for a little while. And we have 17 uh, printable coupons. So let's print those. Uh, how do I grab him? Did I grab him? There we go. Uh, oh. There. Okay. So now I have some coupons on me. 17 coupons. Very nice. And basically what's going in there is some cable and some uh, copper sheets. And we are draining uh, both, I think. Well, we're draining the copper sheets, not the uh, the cable. Mm -hmm. But I have set it up so that the cable is taking priority, you might say. So here, uh, we're, we're taking the copper sheets out here. And then we are actually sending half of them back into the storage and uh, half of them going over here so it's one third of all the copper sheets that we make that we're sending over towards the awesome sink now we do need to use some of these coupons right now uh, but before we do that i believe we have a hard drive done so what can we get here uh, alternate blueprint iron wire uh, alternate blueprint steel frame and alternate blueprint iron ingot oh iron ore water huh. so that's actually quite interesting we're gonna want all the the alternate re recipes but I'm thinking for now we'll let's select the the pure iron ingot and we can stick another hard drive in and start that scanning all right awesome shop so there are some things that we desperately want we want uh, conveyor walls uh, 
That's for dang sure. We have 17 coupons. I would love to get windowed walls as well. Um, some attachments. Uh, the wall power outlets would be really nice. Uh, some of the new foundations would be fantastic. We're going to have to get all of it, but right now, I think the middle conveyor walls is what I want. Um, so that's seven. Actually, wait. Move that. Uh, because this... These are cheaper. Why are these cheaper? So f with that, we can get both the door and the conveyor walls for the same price as just the metal conveyor walls. We will want to get those too, but I can live with ha having these for our starter base, to be honest. Well, that's seven. I'd love to get the windowed walls, but I think uh, wall power outlets would be nice. So that's 11. Pipeline wall attachments, that's 14. Uh, and then foundations. Yeah, let's do that. Cart, total of 17. Buy all. All right. Cool! First time I've used the Awesome Shop. That was fun. Uh, Alright, so we have some stuff on us that we don't really need to have on us, to be honest. Um, we don't need all these. We don't need all the power slugs, but we could just uh, transform them. Let's just do that. No point in having them as slugs when we can just transform them into shards. Alright, so that's a lot of power shards. Oh, a lot, nine. There's power shards. And I think that's fine. Okay. So, what we need to do now is actually disconnect our two iron here and there's another pure iron up here somewhere which we want so that's three pure iron and then we need one more or two normal uh, where is that pure iron uh, oh crap I want iron ore. Why did it not ping the iron ore there? Oops. So there's an iron ore. And it's pure. And... That's three of our four on one side that we can get going with that. So let's start by doing that. Let's start by doing that. Now how long are you? Five minutes. Okay. Alrighty. Now... Hmm. Let's just run over here. Um, that's foundations. Let's set up our uh, hot bars here. 
Um, foundations. I want the glass foundation on seven and the frame on eight. And then walls. Let's do walls here on nine, on ten. So this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. For now, at least. For the transportation. We have these guys, which we won't be using, and not anytime soon, at least. The wall outlets. Which I do want as well. Uh, that'll be a power thing. Um, hmm. I think we'll take the pipes off here. So let's do three, four, five, no, you're two. So that's fine. And then on nine, we'll do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, so that's all good. Now, walls. Um, hmm. Actually, I know exactly what I want. Uh, I want... These walls here. They should be com exactly lined up. Actually... I just need one there. Let's, let's go upstairs. It's gonna be easier. So, yeah, we want one there. And then we want... Which way is which? One there. Are they facing the same direction? Yeah. And then we want one here. Dang it. All right, you know what? I, I think I'll get uh, a bunch of this uh, set up and, and then I'll be back, guys. Uh, so you don't have to watch uh, me uh, do all this and painfully falling down uh, at least once more, probably more like uh, three or four times more. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. So, uh, see you in a few. Right, so I have two of the iron mines going, and they will come over here. Oh, and uh, I need to put some power on here. Um, let's see. If we do that, then you can go there, and then you can go there for now at least. So now they're powered. And stuff is going in. And it should be arriving over here as well any minute. Yep. Come on. There it comes. Being split down to the next four. And we are producing iron ingots. Very nice. And this should be 120 iron ingots a minute per four machines. Which means that we'll have a full belt here. Cool! So that's... Some of our iron ingot production going. Hmm. 
Nice! Alright, now, uh, enough time has passed that our hard drive should be done. So let's go check that out. Oh, I forgot I cut off the cement factory. Concrete factory. So we need to go fix that. But let's have a look at our hard drive. Alternate blueprint steel rod. So one steel ingot to four iron rods. Alternate blueprint solid steel ingot which is iron ingots into and coal into steel ingots. Kind of like that. Kind of like that. Let's select that. All right. Cool. Now we are out of hard drives now. Let's see how many coupons do we have here. Two. Let's just give it some time. Um, but that gives us something to think about for our steel production. Which is not the next thing that we'll be doing, but... It will be coming soon. Now, the idea is, uh, as I think I mentioned, uh, if we take a look here, we have our lines going up here. And the idea is that everything on this side will be going up, and on the other side it will be going down. So, here I have four uh, conveyor thingies, and that's because, dang it, I thought I could jump over there. Uh, because I want them to want either iron or copper to come up there and cross over here and go into these machines. Because I don't want things going up. On, on this side of the building. I want things going down. So yeah. Alright. Uh, I suppose we could put a couple of buffers down here. Why not? Um... Organization, storage container. And I want it here. One, two, three. Ah, damn it. Go the wrong way around. Keep forgetting that it does that. But you should be that way as well. And. Here. Ah. Can I get it? I can. There. Alright. So that means that we can. There is my. There. What? What? One? What? Two? Why won't you go in there? I can't afford. Oh, I need to go get more. Okay. Well, I'll uh, continue setting up some stuff here, and um, then I'll be back. See you in a few. Right. So, a bit has happened here. We're, we're First of all, we're running out of both copper cable and uh, uh, copper sheets down here to send into the awesome sink. So that kind of sucks. But it's not the biggest worry in the world. Uh, also, I have built a little bit here, so we have 16 constructors on this side and 8 constructors on this side, and that is enough to use all of the iron ingots that we'll be making from our uh, 16 iron ingot uh, smelters downstairs. So we have 4 
for making plates and another four for making plates on this side. So a total of eight plate making machines and that will spend 240 ingots uh, per minute. Over here we have 16 machines and that is for making all our uh, iron rods because they only take 15 ingots a minute while the plates take 30 ingots a minute. The rods play, uh, produce 15 ingots a or uh, 15 rods per minute while the iron plates produce uh, 20 plates per minute. So yeah, let's delete that. I just wanted to show you. And down here, the last set of smelters are not hooked up to any iron yet, but uh, they will be. And that will all be fine and dandy. And we have four uh, buffer containers here that will, uh, will send this up. So now, what do we have here? We have a few ingots. Now, ooh, I wonder, will these go in there? I think I made a mistake. So this will definitely go in there. Will this go in there? It will, nice. Okay, so not a problem. And the last one there. Let's head upstairs again and have a look. And as you can see, I have put some glass floors uh, in the center path here for, uh, for the upstairs floor, which I th think looks pretty nice. And basically that'll just be our path to walk on. But we should have ingots coming along. Yes, we do. And we have on all four lines right now because I put some uh, ingots in one of the containers for the line that isn't actually hooked up yet. But it's nice to see that everything gets going. So let's jump up on a machine. I should have left the... Whoa. Whoa. So it's going in and they are producing over on the other side. I forgot a cable here. Uh, not a conveyor belt. Cable. Cable. Alright. So now we're doing, producing rods on this side. And we're producing plates on this side. Which is really nice. And as you can see, it's 30 ingots per minute to make 20 plates. And over here, you can see it's 15 ingots per minute to make 15 rods. So now we need to get all this out and we want it to go down this way and come down. So let's see what we can do about that. I think I'm running out of... Um, of uh, reinforced plates as well, which isn't great. So we want a merger and we want it right there. There, a nice 90 degree angle. And then you can come in. And yeah, see, I am out of reinforced plates and I don't think we're producing anymore because we have stolen all the iron from down here. I uh, doubt it. Nope, no more reinforced plates. So what we basically have to do is... Well, if we could hook up you you're a splitter but you're a merger I don't really want to merge I don't think I can come out this way and get in there to get some rods going so what we could do is because we have a full container of rods here just uh, take some and stick in uh, these machines, unfortunately, they can only hold a hundred. But what we could also do is set up a container for them. 
instead of these guys because they don't have anything to do. So if we take the organization container uh, that way, and I know uh, we we in reality want to, to delete all this, but for now. Let's just get some more uh, screws going so that we can get some more uh, reinforced plates because we desperately need them. Uh, we desperately need them. But I think it's uh, it's going to come together pretty nicely over there at our real starter base, you might say. And there we have... Reinforced iron plates going. We have one more, yay! But anyway, um, I think it's, I think it's going to come together. I think it's going to come together in a nice starter base. And I kind of like when you're running up here that you can look down and see all the ingots moving along. I guess it'll be copper ingots on the other side. It will be, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I think it looks pretty cool. I think it looks pretty cool. So yeah, so uh, yeah, we, we got some iron plates and some iron rods going in our starter base today. And next time, I think we'll get probably reinforced plates, rotors, and maybe modular frames as well going in our starter base here. And of course we need to take some of these iron plates and some of these rods to take down to our storage on the bottom floor. Let's just jump down there so they will be coming down out here. Uh, I think I'll extend this by two, maybe, yeah, probably two, and see, and then it will come down here and go into our personal usage containers here that we have lined up. So yeah, that's the plan. That is the plan. Whoops. Let's just jump up here. Right. And they're going along nicely. It's beautiful. And I guess these are filling up now. Yep. Yep, yep. Filling up very nicely. So that is perfect. So yeah, thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.